Hello, boys and girls. Hello, guess what? It's Mrs. D's time. It's definitely not tea time, but it's here for my new moon class. And you know how we get started. It's with a bear and a rhyme to share, okay? So our bear is still here. He's so wonderful. He keeps coming back. He's healing very nicely. So it's so good to see the bear. Uh, any animals that you stuffed animal you have, don't have to use a bear, but we're doing a bear rhyme, but you can use what you have at home. You ready? Goes like this. Teddy bear, teddy bear, twist around. Teddy bear, teddy bear, slowly fall down. It's okay, bear, I, I, I got you. Good job. <laughs> uh, teddy bear, teddy bear, show your shoes. One, two. <laughs> teddy bear, teddy bear, what else can we do? Hmm, I know you boys and girls got your noggin on your mind. Have some great ideas of what to do. You know my two favorite. <laughs> Teddy bear, teddy bear, go on my hair. <laughs> or, teddy bear, teddy bear, fly through the air. And the many that you have, go ahead and do it, it'll be great. And you know what we can do, always, is give it ourselves. <laughs> All right, great job, boys and girls. All right, well, now that we're done with the rhymes. Uh, so now, boys and girls, it's time to move along to our lullaby song, okay? So let's see, come over here. I'll get this thing going here. I think I have the volume so we can hear it. Yes, there's the music. When we've snuggled in our bed, the moon is waking up instead. Quietly sitting up in the sky, gently singing a moon lullaby, shining with its bright moonlight, wishing everyone good night. Perfect, boys and girls. Great job. Give yourselves another hand. That was wonderful. Now that we've had a lullaby, it's that time. When Mrs. D moves right along, I'm going to put my PJs on and get ready to have a storm bed. So, Mrs. D, let's put your PJs on. All right, first, uh, let me see here. Okay, one arm. And this is the tricky part for all ages, getting dressed, I'm telling you. Okay, there we go. All right, now, we go. We have one snap, two, Three, four, and one more makes five. That's one, two, three, four, five. Five snaps. Now all I need after the five snaps is that nightcap. Keeps me thinking. Well, keeps my head warm. I'm all ready for bed now. <laughs> but you know what? We have a surprise each and every time. It makes me so excited and happy that Mrs. D will bring her a surprise. Can it be? It always is. They're so wonderful. It's Mrs. D and her famous puppy story. One, two, three, and these puppies, look at that. They're snug in that bed. They're ready for that story to be read. So right, right here, puppies, Mrs. D has the story. It's entitled, When the Snow Falls, and I guess what we had yesterday and today. A little bit of Ohio snow, that's for sure. It is uh, written by Linda Booth Sweeney and illustrated by Jana Christie. All right, let's miss a scene. Let's get to that story, please. And that's the beginning page. <clears throat> when the snow falls, frost, paint, skies are gray, windows sparkle on that snowy. Yay! Look at the snow that we have today for sure. Look at that. Grandma zips. Daddy tugs. Belts buckle and hats are snuck. See that? I think the I don't I can guess. Let's see what happens next. This is D. Turn the page, please. Oh my goodness. Boots sink and lashes flick. Tongues tickle. And we lick that snow. You know how you try to catch it with? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Turn the page. 
Barn creaks and horses neigh, bells tinkle and puppies play. When snow falls, <clears throat> tracks curve and skis glide and fox curls and, 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 and rabbits hide in the snow. Woods hush, fields glisten, wren sings and we listen. We listen sometimes when you're out for the birds. But when the snow falls, trains toot, cars go slow, the plow pushes and the mountains grow. Whistles, wheels crunch and shovels scoop, ice cracks, awnings kind of droop with all that snow. <laughs> flakes zag, flakes zigs, grandpa whistles and we dig. Oh. Look at that. Balls roll, mounds pile, carrot stick and a snowman smile. Look at that. That's what we can do. You guys can probably have been doing it. Saucers spin, sleds slide, hats fly, and we ride. Whee! <laughs> Friends flop, snow creeps, we swish. Make angels in the snow. Look at that. See, when the snow falls, toes tingle and lips kind of quiver, cheeks glow and you kind of shiver. Bones chill, winds chase, grandma calls, and we race. Mm, see what's going on. The fire crackles and corn pops, soup simmers and we plop. Cocoa warms and mittens puddle, day floods, but we cuddle. And that's what happens when the snow falls. Oh, boys and girls, that was a great story. So enjoy the snow while we have it. If you're outside, have some time to do that. Now, guess what, though? How exciting can it be? It is. It's time for the guessing game. You guys are so smart, I have no worries. I'm telling you what, today, guess and get Let me get all my stuff together here. This is the please. Take some time, you know, my age. Anyways, it starts with a letter M. It's a letter M, okay? I'm going to sing my song. Let's see if you can figure it out before I'm done. Which one of these is not like the others, you know? One of these things just, oh, let me do it this way, doesn't belong. Excuse me. Can you tell which one is not like the others by the time I finish this song? All right, let's see what we have here. This is a red planet, and it's called Mars. This, oh, oh, oh it might be a little upside down, but it goes that fast, I'm telling you. This is some money, coins, and bills. This is, guess what, very much like ours, a moon, just like a planet. It's not a planet, it's a moon, but it's up in the sky anyways. And then we have the little planet called Mercury. So we have Mars, money, moon, and Mercury. Hmm. I know you already have guessed which one is not like the other. These are up in the sky. This is definitely in hand or here. It's money. And I knew you could guess that. I have another two things. First, I'm going to surprise you because I've forgotten. This is these sometimes even with the noggin hogan work and I forget that we have this little mystery bag and sometimes with the story I have something in here. So let me see. I might not have put anything, but let me see. Oh, I did. And it has to go with our story. It is a snowflake and some snow, which was perfect for when the snow falls, right? All right. But now, the real fun. Our mystery bag. wonder what's in it today. Let's see. Hmm. I'm bring this out here. Sometimes it takes a while, you know. And this is, oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Look at this. 
is a, is a, is a moose with a mustache. My goodness, a moose with a mustache? I know, he thinks he looks so masculine in his mustache, but he also wants to show off all his <clears throat> muscles. Guess what? He looks mighty magnificent to me, I'm telling you, for a moose with a mustache. Well, we'll put you right here, moose with a mustache, and right now, it's time for us to go. So ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I won't see you until next time, but till then, ta-ta for now!